Hey y'all, this is Darcy. We're in Darcy's kitchen. So many people ask me how I make broth and um, I'm making some. It's a new season and it's time to make a beautiful batch of healing bone broth. So um, I will show you what I do here. All right, so here's some ingredients. I've been soaking, um, I order bison bones. These are actually knuckles from uh, North Star Bison. And I've been soaking them in water and a little bit of um, apple cider vinegar. So I've been soaking them for about an hour and then I'll put them, and this is my crock pot, <laughs> Spa Pro, see, see that? <laughs> Here's a hand for size, I'm not gonna touch it. But um, it's a pretty large crock pot and I have it cranked up right now. So I start with a little bit of water, I'm gonna put the bones in, and then I put some hard, <clears throat> some hard um, spices. This is black pepper and fenugreek, which both have an affinity towards um, strengthening Im the immune system, the respiratory system. Um, everything I'm making here is quite medicinal. It's uh, a lot of people make broth in a different way. Um, I use my broad background of Ayurvedic medicine to create a um, real deeply medicinal broth. So the ingredients that you see here, and I'll put some more in later, this will be cooking for three days. <clears throat> and every day I add some uh, apple cider vinegar. I'll, every day I'll add twice the amount of rosemary. You could see this is a very long sprig. It spans longer than my forearm. That's how we measure in different ways in Ayurvedic medicine. So we have ginger, turmeric, and a little galangal. So that's gonna go in. And um, I usually put the hard, all the hard um, <clears throat> spices in first. These are two large onions, um, the larger things, since it's going to be cooking for several days. I'm gonna drain this out and then put these um, knuckles in. You could see there are three large knuckles and by the end, um, they'll be pitted. You'll see white spots on these, these knuckles and the marrow will start coming out of it. And what happens, it's just like, um, it's interesting. Do you ever look at uh, anybody's fingernails who have white spots on them? What that indicates is, is a lack of minerals. So I use my Ayurvedic um, wisdom here to see the opposite is happening. So by daily putting a little bit of apple cider vinegar in this, it draws the minerals out of the bones. And that's what we want. We're taking the broth on a seasonal basis to strengthen the immune system, to um, just to feel good. Some days I fast on it also. So I have a lemon. Yes, there's a lemon here. Um, I squeeze it and then pop it in there, and then there's uh, several t uh, tomatoes, like two to three large tomatoes. Um, I will also put in thyme, and then, <clears throat> these are bison tendons. It's Achilles tendons, actually. They're these long, large tendons. And I use these um, to uh, increase the collagen level. So I'm gonna turn my video off now, and uh, I'll, I'm gonna drain this and put these in there, add more water, cook it. Um, for three days and during the process each day I will add apple cider vinegar. I will add um, more rosemary and Since I did not have celery, it's not in here But usually I put in two stalks of celery just I cut it and clean it and just lay them right in there and um, by the end of um, Day three it is beautiful and delicious and then I strain it and um, put it in these uh, larger curran, uh, curran ball jars. Actually, these are the ones, this size can get frozen. <laughs> uh, the, and then I put it in several of these and it lasts, this is a half gallon. It lasts for um, up to two months in the refrigerator. And then I also use uh, this, this is a uh, quart, what is this, a quartz, you know. I use those as well. But the only ones that you can freeze, and I've learned this through trial and error, are this size. I believe it's a pint size. So um, just to recap, soak the bones with water and some apple cider vinegar first. Crank up your crock pot, add 
the bones, add the ingredients. Uh, you can also do this for 24 hours as well. Every day I put in a, a splash of apple cider vinegar, more water because it'll boil down, um, two of these size um, rosemary, and um, what else? And towards the end I'll put some, <clears throat> some thyme in there. So that's the healing bone broth update. Uh, let me know how it goes for you. Enjoy. Aloha.